Saw them up close. Did you guys get to watch them much live when you were there at all? Uh, a little bit. I mean, they're a really good team. Uh, got good guards and good bigs, so it's going to be a good test. Is it interesting when you I mean, now you're watching them against teams you play, I and mean, you can scout them against Gonzaga and North Carolina, and maybe it gives you a little bit more in them too just because you played those teams as well? A little bit, but, I mean, that tournament was kind of hard. I mean, teams are – it's just hard to – back-to-backs like that, a lot, a lot of teams are tired, so you yeah. don't – you know, it's hard. It's not like a – you get to game plan, so it's different, but – We'll still use it and see, go from there. A game like this seems to always be maybe like the game of the year non-conference wise, but this year it's almost like just another game because the teams you've had to play so far. Yeah. Does that help you guys go into this one? Definitely. I mean, it will help us all year. I mean, um, oh, sorry. Playing big teams like that um, would just prepare us. And I mean, there's a lot of good teams in Pac-12 this year. So um, hopefully that will carry on and, you know, going down the stretch this year, we'll be game ready. Not sure how much you've had a chance to watch them since – the Bahamas, but uh, they appear pretty much live and die by the three. Like when yeah. they're down in the Bahamas, they were really good shooting three. Mm-hmm. The last three games where they've lost, they've not been as effective. Yeah. Um, important will three point defense the against yeah. a team who clearly lives and dies by it. No, definitely. I mean, we're just going to have to play hard defense, close out on the shooters, be aware. Um, but we got to be aware of the big guy inside, too. I mean, can't let him get easy ones. So, I mean, they're just a good team all the way around. So, we just got to be ready to play. Was that game, uh, the Hawaii win, was that kind of good to get kind of back on track, have a good game like that, especially after having that break after mm-hmm. the Bahamas? Definitely. I mean, uh, get our flow back. And, you know, it was a long trip, so just to kind of get our legs back again, too. So You had some early games there, too. This one will be early, really early here, but yeah. noon there. But is that also you guys have kind of adjusted, you know, when, when you were over there to kind mm-hmm. of get in your game schedule to be able to play at whatever time? Yeah, definitely. I mean, when the lights come on and that, that ball gets tipped up, I mean, it don't really matter what time it is to us. We're going to go out there and try to get W. How much of, based on your production, because there are certain stats where, like, you're one of the only guys who've got certain splits that you've got, mm-hmm. is what you've wanted in returning for this year? I mean, you talked about the things you need to improve on, yeah. you need to show it. Do you think you're doing that so far? Uh, yeah, I think, and I think I can even improve upon it. So I think uh, definitely not nowhere where I should be, so. Um, I got a lot of work ahead, so hopefully that can I can just help that te- our team be a little bit better. Where should you be then? If you're nowhere near where you should be. Uh, I mean, I've had games where I haven't shot the ball as well that probably um, affected the outcome a little bit. So I wish I could have those back, but just shooting a bit a little bit better and and defending at a, a high level again.